What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading capsule inside your everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply to that fly, everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the, re uh, leave the rest. Um, I received a channel message in, uh, so I'm doing this video. Uh, holy crap, you guys. I just want to say this before we get started. Um, I was in there making myself some bacon, egg, and cheese McMuffin griddles. And, oh my gosh, my stove caught on fire. It was a grease fire. My stove caught on fire. Usually, I mean, it's happened several times before in the four and a half years I've lived here. Almost five. Um, usually you turn it off and it goes down. It did not go down. It got worse this time. A lot worse. So bad. I had to end up calling the fire department out here because the entire house was filled with smoke. I got some smoke damage on the top of my cam uh, cabinets above. My stove is completely out. Um, and I already had to call a plumber because my sink in my kitchen has been backed up for a week. <laughs> So I got to call a plumber and get a new stove and I've got counter damage uh, from the smoke damage, uh, which is crazy. So I'll have to call my insurance company, uh, mortgage company, all that and get it handled. Um, it is what it is. Adult life, hashtag adult life, but um, it is what it is. I love you guys so much. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day or wonderful night, 11 p.m. on 4 22 um, Just saying, just saying. Okay, so um, the channel message I received was um, someone cannot quit thinking about you. That's what I heard. Um, someone cannot quit thinking about you. So what a odd reading <laughs> to do. I don't ever get those uh, kind of channel messages. I just don't. We all know that. I get fires. I get police involvement. I get crimes. I get dead body parts washing up on shore. Um, I get secret seven. Um, I get crimes. I don't get someone thinking about you. Um, so, you know, you plug it in how it resonates, but I, I guess somebody's thinking about you. So you plug it in how it resonates. And my kitties are missing. They're missing. Um, after the fire department left, I thought they were hiding under the beds. I cannot find them. So I don't know what in the world I'm going to do. My kids are going to be crushed um, if I don't find the cats. Um, I'm serious about that. They're a part of our family. So uh, oldest we've had for about four and a half years. The youngest, two and a half. So I don't know. I hope. I don't know. I don't know. Spirit messages you have for the podcast beginnings growth number two or five could be very significant numbers in one's life two or five it could be possible ages of children or years or somebody you're connected to possible lottery number possible date of birth number possible dream card number possible jersey number um two or five beginnings and growth New beginnings coming for many people. Healthy, positive connections this time. Oh, wow. Well, okay. I heard new beginnings coming for many people. Healthy, positive connections for many people. So, well, that's beautiful. Um, I didn't think I was going to receive any channel messages after just um, experiencing a house fire. And I'm just being serious. I mean... You know everything's okay it's okay like my house is intact thank goodness and um it's not terrible damage it's not terrible i mean the, the stove's out so i can't cook um but you know i have a microwave even though some of the fire got onto the microwave and melted a little bit of the knob uh the open knob but it's still it's, i'm i don't know i plugged it back in yet but hopefully that still works but I didn't think I was going to get any channel messages is what I'm trying to say. Uh, 
Um, but I heard new beginnings uh, for many of you guys, new beginnings and um, healthy, positive connections this time. It's not toxicity. So, um, and you got beginnings coupled with growth. See, look, smoke, smoke from the fire. I just noticed that. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So new beginnings here, um, healthy, positive connections, not toxic ones um, is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it re resonates and then growth. Someone really, really, really wants to grow with you. Several shocking series of chain of events are going to occur. They're about to contact someone. They know they know of criminal activity in the past. They're about to contact someone to get you the money you deserve. Oh, my God. Whoa. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Holy crap. Um, I heard someone really wants to grow with you. So somebody, I think, sees a life with you. They really want to grow with you, but they know about some kind of criminal activity against you or somebody you're connected to in the past, how that plugs in. And I heard they're about to uh, contact someone because of the criminal activity of the past. Um, now, whoever they're going to contact, local police, feds, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, I'm not sure, but they're about to contact somebody. It's either criminal activity against you or someone you're connected to, um, however that plugs in, but they want to grow with you. They see, uh, I think they actually see a life with you. I don't think, I don't feel this is player energy. I don't feel this is um, immature player energy. I feel this is mature or maturing energy. I feel this person actually wants a relationship um, and they want to do it right this time with you. Um, whoever you are and how this plugs in. Um, I feel the person that wants to grow with you and create these new beginnings with you, I feel they're the ones about to call either police or feds or somebody about some kind of criminal activity done against you in the past um or somebody you're connected to how that resonates um how that resonate it's really beautiful Okay, I didn't hear anything else. Wow, this is really beautiful, you guys. All right. Let me pull one of these and then I'll close it. Spirit message, okay. Letting go. Protection. Number 35 or 21 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 35 or 21, it could be possible ages of years, somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible brain card number, possible jersey number, 35 or 21. Letting go. Someone has been forced to let go of toxicity. Forced. They did not want to, but they had to. It's about to create many, many series of chain events positively for you. Okay, I heard someone um, was forced to let go of uh, toxicity. So they did not want to let go of this toxicity in some shape, form, or fashion, but they were forced to let it go. Um, I feel they were finding you in some kind of toxic relationship or toxic situation but they were forced to let it go they were forced to let it go there it's probably benefiting them in some shape form or fashion but they were forced to let it go but i heard it's about um things are going to turn around positively for you so they were forced to let go of some kind of toxic situation in some shape form or fashion but it's going to go good for you new beginnings and growth for you and um they had to let you go um i think they were binding maybe there were some they were performing binding spells some they were just did not want to let go because it was benefiting them but it was dragging you down how would this resonate protection 
Number 35 or 21 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 35 or 21, protection. You're about to have a lot of protection soon, a lot. Behind the scenes and in the physical. A lot of changes are coming here soon. Oh my God, I heard you're about to have a lot of protection behind the scenes and in the physical. Uh, a lot of changes are coming here soon. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. So you're about to have a lot of protection, uh, whatever kind of protection that is, behind the scenes and physical. So in your 3D physical world and behind the scenes, I think it's all this communication of this criminal acts that was done against you or somebody you're connected to. And the person that's interested in you, I think for... A, um, a relationship, like a healthy relationship, I think they're about to speak on this. I think they're about to speak on it. Um, somebody else was trying to hold on to you. They were trying to, they were, some they were latched the hell on, but they were forced to let go of you, basically, um, because they were dragging you down um, with their toxic behavior or behaviors or whatever the hell it was. Um, but you're protected now. You're protected now. Um, Behind the scenes, I heard, about to be behind the scenes and about to be in the 3D. It doesn't sound like this has happened yet, but it sounds like it's about to. Um, behind the scenes and in the 3D. So some kind of protection energy. I don't know if that's protection order or a restraining order or um, or maybe the love interest that comes in and wants to grow and build with you. Maybe they are a good protector. Um, I'm not sure. Only you know your story, not anybody else. Only this person that wants to grow and build with you, knows their story, not anybody else. Um, and I heard lots of, cha lots of change was coming and change was underneath protection. So 555 energy, number 12, could be a very significant number. Um, change here, it's about to bring change. Wow. Soon, someone is about to be very, very, very honest about the past. Very honest. And you're about to learn of several people. Some are already in jail. Some are about to go to jail. Okay, wow. I heard, um, okay, so soon you're about to learn about the past, uh, whoever you are and how, if this applies for you. Uh, soon you're about to learn about the past, so that could be the protection and the change too, protecting you um, by telling you the truth and change coming uh, because you will learn about the past in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and that's a form of protection too when you know what you what you need to deal with. When, you know, people that try to protect you by not telling you things, I don't like that. I don't like that because I like to know it all, down and dirty, period, point blank for me. Because I know what I'm dealing with. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's different though. But I like to know what the hell I'm dealing with. And that's just the truth. Um, but somebody's about to come clean with you about the past. I think for some it might be this love interest. Um, that's interested in growing and building with you. For some it might be somebody else. But they're about to be um, honest with you about the past. Um, and that could be, a, like I said, I think that's a form of protection too. Um, it's going to create change. Um, positive change is coming for you. Um, and I heard for some of you guys, you're about to learn about people already in jail. Um, and for some, you're about to learn about people about to go to jail. For some, you can learn about both. People already in jail. Sounds like currently in the energetic space. And some are about to go to jail. Some, it could be both. Um, um, that could be the letting go too. Letting go of toxic people. Learning the truth on these toxic people. And letting go the fact that they made their choices to whatever the hell they did to go to jail. And... Um, that was their choice. Um, I feel it's probably big crimes there. I don't like blue collar, white collar rest crimes. Um, and I'm serious about that for some. That you plug it in, how it resonates, um, which is going to bring a lot of change.
Okay. I didn't hear anything else. All right, you guys, we're done. I hope this helped and namaste.